Hoo -hoo. Evening, morning, whatever. If you didn't watch the last episode, then you should go and watch it now. You'll see that I was gonna pull out the roof. I pulled it out. It's left a uh, fair stack of stuff. But it's out, look. Oh, and you can just walk in. State of it. You can see the lean on that bad boy now. Uh, yeah. Oh, it's in good condition. Oh, I'll take all these walls out and all that. But I probably won't film that in this episode. That's why I didn't film taking the ceiling, floor, roof thing out. It was pretty dangerous as well, so. But those beams are pretty good. I mean, some of them have got uh, seen better days, but I can chop that and use it somewhere. That one's actually particularly bad. A couple of them are good. Mmm, that wall was a delight. I want to see what's behind it. Took all the wood off it. What have we got? Ooh. Nice logs. Ooh. Oh, that looks nicer, doesn't it? Yes, you can see that's on a lean as well. Look, bows down that way. Rip. Ah. Should have got a place that was just starting from scratch rather than demolishing all this old stuff. This is from, oh, I found a paper look. Nineteen forty. But I think this is uh this part of the barn is an extension because it's a different, it's a total different style to the rest of it. Yeah, I think it might have been a little add-on. Uh, but there's loads of horrible stuff in here as well, right there. Obviously I had animals shackled up and that, so... No thanks. Wow, it's nice when the wind picks up in here. All the sawdust and that that was on this ceiling roof bit. Ugh, all blows right in your mouth. That's all looking good as well now, isn't it? Alright, strip that little bit of wall off, see what that's like, but it's not looking good already, is it? It's all coming off anyway, like, right? but... Tell you what this barn needs. Nice bit of wallpaper. That's gorgeous, that, isn't it? Mmm. Bendy. Nothing interesting behind it. Uh, I guess I should bag all this. For it all blows into the forest and chokes some chipmunks. Oh, well, ran out of bags super fast. So there's only a little bit of tethers left anywhere. So if the chipmunks get it, it's not my fault. It's yours. Just joking. There's no chipmunks here. Milk. Roll up, roll up. Get your sawdust. Well, that is just looking beautiful. Just that little bit and all that wall. And then this massive pile of bricks and all that and all that and all that and all that and all that. And all that. So just this outer clad to do then. Get this some frozen door out. That is that proper frozen in there. Windows out though. Right. That's most of it exposed. 
just got that little bit to do, but I'm pulling it off because it's a nightmare. I need to figure out if I'm just going to keep this like this, so it's like an open, obviously sort out all this rubbish, but keep it so it's like an open part of the barn that can be used for something, but it's just like this. Maybe just replace all these that are all rotten. I bet I'd have to prop it up with like acros or something and realign it like there. You see where it's split. Raise that, raise that end, and raise these two with big metal, sort of like jacks. And then I uh, replace all the bad bits because I really don't want to tackle the roof because it's asbestos. I was going to just cut all the inside of the boards all the way along there and then consider just pulling it down right. and then it'd be easier if I just chopped out all the legs, all the support legs and just let it tumble and then deal with it but either way I still have to deal with the asbestos so I need to have a think about that I don't want to rush into it because once I've committed to it I've committed to it you know so we'll see but at least it's exposed and I can see the sheer damage of it. I need to clear all the floor and clear all that brickwork out and all that jazz, but I'm not going to do a full video of that. I'm going to give it a break. I'm a little bit bored of it, to be honest. <laughs> Well, that escalated fast. I just gotta dig a few paths out. <clears throat> well, I said I'd pick up the uh, girlfriend from the nearest village, but I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to drive there. Because the road's not been cleared and snow drifts, I don't wanna get a little bit down there and get stuck. So it looks like I'm going to have to walk it, which should be uh, fun, eventful. See how it goes. You can come with me. Even the snow drift here is pretty bad. <laughs> Tis the season to be jolly. Whew, it's cold in there to retrieve my boots because these ones Not very waterproof anymore. Right, let's do this. Could have driven that, wasn't that bad. Yeah, driveway's filled up again though, so I have to dig that open and all the the bits of the well is all snowed in as well, so but I won't bore you with showing you me clearing it. I'll catch you when I've finished. See you soon. Barn took a bit of a beating as well. But I've got the paths done. Pumped some water which is also fun because of the amount of snow that hey ho it is Christmas time after all eh?
yellows. I don't know if he's just hunting for voles and mice or taking interest in the ducks. Eh? Little fella? I'd prefer you didn't and you went away, please. If that's alright. He's in there. Look, you see him. Should have brought a pack lunch. I can't sit there all day seeing if the little stoke comes back, but it doesn't seem too interested. I'm gonna have to put a hold on this now it's all buried. Great timing. Well, it's okay, I have other things to do. I'm gonna go and weigh and check all the duck eggs in the incubator, make sure they're all right. But I'll show you a little bit of that, shall I? Me as well. Day eight done. Right, just put the big ducks away. I don't know if you can see me, so I don't know if I'll keep this footage, but I shall see you in the morning. Morning. Just uh, sorting out the tomatoes and stuff, even though nothing will be getting planted out for a long time now. Um, but that's time growing inside. I'll insert a little video of it here so you can have a little look at those little bad boys quite nice coming along well for just growing in the cabin but we'll see what happens uh, and apart from that uh, I think I'm gonna have to end this video early uh, get it uploaded for release tonight uh, and yeah and I shall see you in the next one guys if you haven't already please like and subscribe check out patreon chat to me in the comments and uh yeah, sorry for cutting it short, but better to just cut it, start a new video for next week. I've got a lot of things to do, so I shall see you soon. Have a good one. Have a nice week, and uh, bye.